From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather in today's top stories, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Much colder out there today compared to what we have been seeing over the past few days. Temperatures only getting up into the mid to upper 30s, 36, 37 degrees for your afternoon highs with those clouds slowly moving. And we saw some clear skies this morning. Expect mostly cloudy skies throughout the afternoon with those winds hovering right around 15 to 20 miles per hour. Now, as we make our way throughout the next few days, going to be a little bit of a roller coaster ride with these temperatures. Temperatures in the 30s today and tomorrow up into the 40s on Wednesday. And yes, even the 50s on Thursday. But with that is going to bring some rain and then those temperatures drop back down and that rain could turn to snow. I'm Terrence Lee with your top stories. A man who was reported missing weeks ago has been found dead. Cleveland police are investigating his death as a homicide. Officers responded to a home on Turbinson Drive for a welfare check. They found mail and newspapers piled up in front of the house. Police went inside and found a decomposing body in a bedroom. The medical examiner says the 67 year old man died from blunt force trauma to the head. The victim's name has now been released. If you have any information, give Cleveland police a call. Canton police are looking for this man, Curtis Williams. He's accused of shooting a man on Midway Avenue Saturday night. The man died at the hospital. Police arrested another man, Mitch Greenleaf, in connection with the deadly shooting. If you have any information about Williams' whereabouts, call Canton police. The Worcester City Council is getting set to vote on a controversial ordinance. A proposal would let police find someone for sleeping on the streets when there is space available in a shelter. The ACLU Ohio sent a letter arguing the law is unconstitutional and a waste of money. There's a third reading and a final vote tonight at 730. We'll let you know what happens. Check back later tonight for another update. Download the News 5 app for breaking news and alerts. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.